Viola, I'm sorry I was wrong about her. I missed out on a lot of potential about her. Not that I'm 100% wrong about her, but I certainly did miss out what I should have seen in her. Welcome everybody, this is Shinobi once again with another Awaken Chaos Era video. So a warm welcome to all my viewers, especially those incredibly awakened 547 subscribers. So if you have not subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. If possible, share my videos, but certainly do like it. Okay, so with that out of the way, let's talk about what I was uh, looking at Viola. Okay, so let's have a look at her. So I was talking to uh, in our content creator chat and I was talking to um, Bolin about look how hard it is for you know like people to just finish off whatever hard using only epics. Um, so she was like why don't you use Viola and I said I did test her out you know like she's not really that great um, but why don't you use this thing and see if you can beat uh, the flow. Yeah so I certainly missed out on a lot of potential that Viola can do, even though I'm not 100% wrong about her. The only reason I'm not 100% wrong about her or this team is that you'll have to ascend them. Okay, you have to do, do some painting on their stars, get them to five star. Otherwise, this team is a 100% epic team and it's so, so good. Okay, I thank Bullen for that, the Ace team for that. Um, they did give me uh, that idea about it. Uh, so as you all know, Bullen, um, sorry, not Bullen. <laughs> okay, Viola, once she's ascended, she can stun two people if there are three or more uh, debuff on that mob, okay? So she can stun two of the enemy mobs. Uh, and she can place two of those uh, debuffs that we require to complete that three uh, requirement, okay, the three debuff requirement. So you, she can do that on her ultimate and it's an AOE ultimate. The second person that I'm using on this team is my uh, Okubi. So let me just show you. Again, uh, it will be better to get him to Ascension 5. Um, does he require Ascension 5? Yeah, he does require Ascension 5. Okay, so he places Demonic Flora and that places random stats down to the target for any ally's negative effect. And it can be uh, triggered three times per round. So that means that if there is all, uh, uh, if, if the Demonic Flora is there and you're placing negative effect on someone, that person would be getting another additional random stats down uh, for two turns. Okay, so you're basically able to get more debuffs on everybody so you've got this as your debuffer so that's okobi over there and then the next hero that i'm going to use is going to be a level 51 okay again you do need her in ascension 5 okay that's the only problem with an epic team you have to get them to ascension 5 so why am i using myla over here because when you ascend her to 5 she gets an ice shield that's fine she gets that at the start of the battle for two turns but attacks have 50 percent chance to apply frozen to the target for one turn plus 25 percent chance to apply frozen per negative effect on the target so that means if you have two negative effect on the target it's a hundred percent chance to apply that freeze okay and its cooldown is one wave i understand this is going to be trouble but basically her basic ability also has got this uh, she can place the defense down on when when using her basic ability and on her ultimate ability she deals 100 percent damage to all enemies plus 80 percent extra time uh, damage to the main target damage scales with the number of negative effects on the target okay so this skill of her is like really really cool okay now when you see uh, that you know like the cooldown is one wave what i have found is that uh, the cooldown is probably for the ice shield and not for uh, the uh, the 
chance to freeze okay she is freezing every time because that's what i'm seeing i'll show it to you she's uh, every single time she goes and hit it freezes she's able to freeze that one single target and if she's using an aoe then everybody gets frozen so she's basically just like tia but then she's going to deal more damage based on the number of negative effects that's there and the fourth one is obviously my baron so i'll just show you uh, the gear on my uh, myla so i've got her in a curse sand because i want her to attack as many times as possible uh, and then i have her with 73 percent focus the reason why i have her only at 73 percent focus is because i have viola she has got that passive to give me 50 uh, additional 50 focus so i don't have to worry about getting all my heroes to 100 percent focus i can get them to 70 focus and that's sufficient in white tower hard okay so let's look at flow 90 i was able to reach flow 90 using this team um, so let's look at flow 90 and then we can say whether this team works or not okay all right so we are here at flow 90 the boss stage okay the boss wave um, so let's go ahead and see um, how this team is going to function in this stage what i'm going to do right now is to place this the demonic bloom okay so let's get that flower out there so you can see already i have a stun over there and that's because my okobi is on a stun set so don't think that it is because of uh, his skill in any way okay so that's not because of that now i can place this uh the two debuffs that my viola is going to place and so i'm trying to get my mitesia and that edicris stunned so hopefully i can stun mitesia and edicris so you saw that they both got stunned all right now let's go ahead and do some damage on everybody and then get my viola to do this on that vans so they are all frozen i had stuns i had frozen so everything went fine now you can see that everybody has got around three to four debuffs on them uh, i'm going to st uh, stun the edicris and mitesia that's what i'm looking at at this time but unfortunately it was not mitesia that got stunned that's fine that's perfectly fine uh, let's do this AOE hit on them to see if I can proc some stuns from the stun set that I have got on Viola. So she too is on a stun set and Mitesia got stunned. Let's do some more damage on everybody. And then get v uh, my Myla to freeze Vance. So Vance is going to get frozen there. So everybody has got frozen. And now their debuff is no longer there. Okay, it's not a problem if Vance is going to one shot my uh, Myla. I'm not worried about it because I've got last breath here, so I can always get her back. All right, so let's get Myla back and try to do something to that Mitesha. So Mitesha stunned, and that demonic uh, bloom has got has taken out. Uh, that's out of the picture now. Let's stun Edicris once more. I want to be sure that Edicris does not take another turn uh, and try and do as much damage as possible now using Baron's ultimate. So Baron did her ultimate. So there you go. Now I'm going to do some damage using my Myla because they have got so many debuffs on them. They have so many debuffs on them. Myla's head should scale with the uh, number of debuffs on everybody but Vance is not going to get it, take a lot of damage because she uh, he has got only one debuff all right so let's do the demonic bloom again and see the effect of it now I have got a lot of people on stun and of course I want Edicris, I wanted Edicris to be stunned as well but unfortunately Edicris is not stunned I would have preferred Edicris to be stunned but he got stunned because my viola is on a stun set so i've got everybody stunned and then they have not had taken any turn and i'm still able to finish it finish them off so next time on whenever i hit both of them are going to get stunned because i have got plenty of debuff on everybody okay i've got plenty of debuff but i'm going to concentrate on edicris and you can see that everybody is stunned that's because of viola's trade she can consistently keep everybody stunned 
and if you have got less than if you got less than four people then you can be sure that everyone is always going to be either stunned or frozen so you just have to take out one person from that team from the enemy team and everybody else will be stunned so let's go ahead and do the A2, uh, the special on Viola. So Mitesha is out of the picture. And this Edicris over here is never going to take a turn because he's always, always, always going to get stunned. I, even if I don't, I don't kill him using a lot of skills, he is basically going to be stunned every single round. You can see that he's stunned. He cannot do anything against you. And that's why I said that I missed out on the potential of Viola. I am so sorry about it to all my viewers, especially those mid-game players. I really, really miss that out. I should have tested her more extensively using much more, uh, many more heroes. You can also use your Tia over here, okay? I'm just saying you don't have to use Myla, uh, Myla but Myla is an epic and I'm using her at 50, okay? She's in level 50, and so and that's why Using Tia would be much more beneficial as far as I'm concerned, uh, but it's not necessary for you to use Tia. You can see that Edicris over here, he's not going to, he's never, never, never going to take a turn if he's the only hero there. With these two debuff, with that debuff for Okubi over there, and with Viola, that Edicris is never going to move. Of course, there will be other heroes like Light Brand. All right, he is going to be a mess. He is going to be a mess. So, what do you think about that team? I know Viola team is going to be a problem in certain areas, especially in places where you have Brand the Brilliant. There, it's going to be a problem because it's really, really tough when these heroes are taking those additional turns. Okay. You are stunned, and why do you move next? I understand you do have got your special, that is, your rage completely full, but it's not your turn. <laughs> anyway, it's because of that that this team will be failing in certain areas. You will have to use certain other heroes there, but I think, like, overall, as far as Epic team is concerned, the Viola Okubi team is one of the best teams that can be there. Okay, you can go up to floor 94 without any problems, except a few flows in between where you have got that brand the brilliant. So let me know what you think about this team. Let me know in the comment below. And yeah, I'm sorry. I should have tested Viola much better. Yeah, so that's it from me today. Until next time, peace, love and blessing to all of you. Bye.